Games viewers, Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. I mentioned before about the importance of exploring Skyrim. Its lush landscape yields not only many unmapped places, which are fun to find, some quests require your character to travel from one area to another. Pieces of the Past is a good example. You can only fast travel the locations you have found. Exploring makes it easier for your character to get from place to place. I mentioned Pieces of the Past. What I'm going to do is show you a path that leads to the Temple of Meru's Dagon as well as the Lordstone. It is to the right of the Hall of the Vigilant, as you can see on the map. You will see a rocky point and a standing stone. Walk toward the standing stone. This path is relatively easy and safe. You might encounter some wildlife or something else. I'm going to fast forward until we get to something more interesting. On a clear day, you get some beautiful views of the area surrounding this mountain. There's a dead vigilant. What's going on here? Well, I'm going to take everything because he's not using it anymore. Along the path, you will find Dim Hollow Crypt, which is the starting point for the Dawn Guard add-on. That explains the Dead Vigilant as well. I'm going to fast forward this clip until we get to something more interesting. When you near the temple, you will encounter a leveled creature, in this case, an ice wraith. You can easily walk past the stairs that lead up to the temple. As you can see on the map, the temple is not shown yet. Walk up the stairs to the temple. You will not be attacked unless you are active in the pieces of the past quest. Further along the path is the Lord Stone. I'm going to try and kill the bandits that are there via the stealth method and shooting them with arrows.
that failed miserably, I guess I'm just going to have to fight it out. I'll try and make this quick. Those under the sign of the Lord are more resistant to both magic and physical damage. You may only have one sign blessing at a time. Cancel. From the Lord's Stone you can see Mayrun's temple and you get some good views of the valley below. Let's take a walk around and see what we can find. There are some beautiful views from up here, but nothing of real importance. I'm Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. As always, thanks for stopping by.